What's up guys? Royale with Cheese here and welcome yeah, to another episode of ARK Survival Evolved from Syntax Cluster Server. How's everybody doing today? I'm having an amazing day today because I'm finally back on the internet. You guys may have noticed I have been absent from the internet for almost two weeks. I think like 10 days we didn't have internet. Apparently there was some crazy construction thing that happened in my city and it knocked out one of the huge internet lines. I have, I don't know, but they've been telling me we're going to be back on forever, but I'm finally back. So I'm super excited to be back. Great to be back and making content and seeing you guys again. I'm going to be doing tons of videos. I think we're going to be doing two videos a day, an ARC video and a Minecraft video every day to make up for our lost time. What is making all that noise? Oh, it's a penis horse. So on today's episode, we're back here on Scorched. Um, I want to find a new place to live. As amazing as our base is, now, I mean, I got to be honest, I do I do love the base. It's pretty great. But uh, we need a better base. This is just, uh, you know, it was okay, starter base. It's a, not, it's a decent place to spawn. Is that a wyvern over there? What? Did I just see something past that rock? So on today's episode, I want to fly around and look for a new base location. Uh, figure out where we're going to make our actual base. And if we find one, we're going to try to tame up a thorny dragon. So if you guys enjoy this episode, or you're happy to see Cheese back, I want to see everybody that watches this video. Hit that like button because I'm back. Let's get some views going. Let's get some momentum back on the channel. Because I missed you guys, and I'm glad to be back. But if you like this video, smash that like button. And for more daily video game awesomeness... Don't forget to subscribe. So we're just gonna get right into it. We're gonna grab the Chugly. Uh, Chugly's got a level. Oh, he's got six levels. How does the Chugly have six levels? Uh, clearly melee damage. All melee damage. The Chugly's—he's a lover and a fighter. Why can't I fly? Okay, we're going. Um, now around the obelisks are good places to live. Uh, just because of there's always water. Green Ob, eh, I'm not loving this uh, location too much myself. So let's take a cruise around. I heard Pray Tell through the comments that there is a nice place near Red Ob. Man, I really hate the look of this map. It's just uh, me in general, though. Like, I don't like desert maps. When PUBG came out with their desert map, I didn't like it. When I just don't like the brown. I just don't find it appealing to my eye. I really prefer... Is it actually raining? We're getting some hot desert rain right now. Let's go. Um, I guess we let's fill up our water deal. Uh, wait, what is that? See that guy fall out of the sky over there? Oh, it's a it's a titan. We'll have to remember that guy. Cause <laughs> you remember. <laughs> All right. Um, so we're gonna look around. I mean, there's the water areas down here in the bottom of these ravines. I don't really know. Uh, Red Ob's over that way. Let's cruise over towards Red Ob and see. I heard there's a nice area over there. Um, I don't, I'm not really sure, to be honest. I've played this map quite a bit, to be honest, but all everything looks the same. Like, where? I mean, what makes for a good location on this map? Like, you get one tree? I Like, I don't know. You know, there's just... <laughs> there's just not, like, a lot of... Everything is brown and... Rocks and sand. It's all of it. It's just brown sand and rocks. So, mm, I don't know. There's this area over there. Let's see if we can find something cool over by Red Ob. Let's, let's cruise over this way. I love that when you land on the ground with the owl, it doesn't, like, break your uh, speed boost. You can still just, like, take off and get, like, the crazy speed boost thing. Let's see. And you guys normally are right. Normally when the comments tell me... Wow, we're getting some crazy HNLA, LNA, like, spaceship action right now. Uh, normally when the comments tell me something, they're usually pretty close to right. So, I hear that over here is a pretty good spot. Now, unfortunately, there's already somebody that agrees and think this is a good spot. This looks like Jim. I think this is... This looks like Jim's owl. I mean, can we... Yeah, yep, Jim. So, alright, well... That's uh, it for that spot. I mean, we could obviously be neighbors with Jim, but I mean, this is a huge map, and I think there's like four active people on the entire cluster. I'd be kind of a jerk move to live right next to Jim. <laughs> like, 
I like Jim and all, but you know, we probably, I mean, we should probably give him his space and spread out a little bit. Um, man, that's a bummer. I was hoping that would be the, our, our dream spot. Uh, so now, where? Well, Blue Ob is that way. It's, I'm having a hard time seeing right now. It's oddly foggy because of the rain. It's really a weird, we've got a weird environment going on right now. Let's go towards, is that even blue ob over there? That is, right? Let's go check out the blue orb, blue ob, not orb. What? Let's check out the blue orb and ob situation. Maybe that'll be a little bit better. And if that's not it, then we're just going to plunk ourselves down next to water somewhere. Maybe we'll just live next to green ob. I just wanted to, I don't know. I feel like there's got to be some amazing, beautiful spot that I'm missing. Okay, hold on. We were talking about thorny dragons. There's like 18 thorny dragons right here. Are any of you guys a good level? A 6, perfect. 66, a 66, and a 42. Okay, they're all junk. Those are not the ones. You're the one that I don't want. Woo, woo, woo. You're the one that I don't want. Thorny dragon. All right. Uh, Let's see. We're also not getting any good drops right now. Everything is like blues and greens. Bad time. We picked a bad time of day to fly around on Scorched Earth, clearly. Looks like there's a purple drop in our path we can grab, though. We really need to start doing some caves. We need better uh, desert cloth. Our desert cloth is primitive. That's why we're wearing ghillie right now, because our primitive desert cloth, although it works fine, it's just the durability is uh, literally gone. You bump your toe on the coffee table and it breaks your uh, boots. It's like, oh. Okay, uh, blue ob living situation. Let's see what we got. I just can't see. It's so cloudy and foggy. Eh, get us over there one day. It's a lot farther than I thought it was. What do we got here? Scorpions. Nothing good. RGs, rock golems. We got a lot of terrible things over here. All right. Now, okay. I'm I'm feeling this. This looks reasonably cool. We could, hmm, let's see. We could either leave, live up here on the edge of this cliff, which might be pretty cool. I actually kind of like that. And then we could have like a road in from this side and from this side. So if we lived like right here, like right, right where this rock is, I feel like this could be pretty cool. Oh, what's this rock over here? We've got a natural dong. With a deodon? It's a deodon? Why are you only level 12? I don't know. I, I... That's not bad. That's not bad right there. We can make a pretty cool base right there in that spot. And there's ways up around, so, like, you'll be able to get your dinos in. How terrible is... Is there, like, gonna be constantly, like, T-Rexes and stuff falling down the hill on me? Actually, we could, like, wrap all the way around. If we had a base that, like, wrapped all the way around this rock, that would be a lot of work, but be pre pretty cool. What's this? Sabers. We're still looking for thorny dragons. I think this might be our spot, guys. I think that we might claim this uh, for the for the cheeple, the team of cheese. The cheese people. I think we might live. We might settle down here. It's, like, a little bit green, at least. I'm going to try to leave as many trees as I can. Because I don't like the look of just everything being brown. But as far as like being populated with like actual plants and stuff, this is pretty, pretty high concentration for this map. Oh, thorny dragon. What are you? An 18? Why are all the thorny dragons terrible? And there's 52 micro raptors over there as well. That's awful. But I, I mean, we have water everywhere on, uh, we're using S plus with the water everywhere. So we can, we can literally make a water tap anywhere, but I still don't want to like live in a terrible spot uh is this so we're right next to the actual desert desert which is cool i'll have to check the deep sea drop uh locations it'd be really neat if there was like deep sea drops like right over here close to us that would be super handy um yeah i think that's gonna be it guys so i think we're gonna set up a shop there i don't think we're gonna actually get into any building today is there uh oh there is let's go give me the tell me things uh, was that a mantis? Mantis dossier. Let's go. Um, I don't think we're gonna build much today because we're gonna we're still looking for 
a thorny dragon. I know we have a bunch of gathered dinos, but I kind of want to use the ones that we have for the map. So I want to get like a Morella Tops and a thorny dragon and harvest the things here. And I think we're going to bring over a chemistry table, make a chemistry table, our chemistry bench and bring one over and make all our adobe over here uh, using actual dinos from the map. Just, you know, for more fun and more of a challenge. But I'm going to look around now for a thorny dragon to tame up or potentially a couple if we get lucky. So far, the highest one I've seen is a 66. So that's not the one we're going to tame for sure. Uh, yeah, but when I find something cool, we'll be right back. And we're back. I've gotten myself into a bit of a dilemma. All right, so I, I found this super cool ruins. We could make this the front of the base, like if this is our entrance here, and then build like a base back here. That would be really, really neat. But I don't like the landscape nearly as much. Like it doesn't look... Everything else looks kind of way crappier. So, I don't know. Comment down below. What do you guys think? We're going to, I'll leave it up to you guys. Do we want to live here with the super cool ruins entrance way we could make? So this could be really, really neat entrance. Or over there where it's the water and the nice trees and the actual better looking landscape. So what, whatever you guys think. Let me know what you think. Also, I was like, oh my god. And there's thorny dragons trapped right here. Tell me they're amazing. And the no, they're both level twelves. Like seriously, come on. They're <laughs> How perfect would that have been if they were like a 180 and a 174 like mated pair? Nope, both level twelves. All right, I'm gonna keep looking around for thorny dragons, and we'll be right back. And we're back. I found a thorny dragon central. There's a bajillion thorny dragons over here. Uh, most of them are junk levels. But one of them up here, which one is it? Oh, there it is. Uh, that one, the blackish one is 174. So that's the one we're going for. But like I said, there's like a hundred of them. So we're gonna have to eliminate some of the, the riffraff here. Are you on? Yeah, I'm passive, okay. Let's see how, we haven't been on in about 10 days. How's our bow shot doing? We still have our skills. Oh, we got our skills, baby. Okay, that guy didn't even get mad. There was another one up here. Where did he go? There's so many around. Oh, those ones are chasing. Oh, that saber is not a good. No, no. No, saber. Go that way. Oh, no. No, go away. All right, that one's good. All right, that's good, too. Oh, there, there he is. Let's get this one out of the way. And before I accidentally kill mine. All right, I know you're shooting your deals at me. Relax, relax, relax. Get wrecked. Okay. Now you are the 174, correct? Before we start. Yes. Okay. Let's go. We're we're doing it. We're doing it. All right. There's a day on. There's some other bad stuff around. But this guy's actually positioned really well up here on this rock. Actually, if he's stuck right there in that little spot, that would, could be excellent for us. I mean, he's not, but if he goes to run and like... Don't get yourself killed now. I won't, HLNA. Thanks for the tip, though. It's amazing coaching. Should I keep my eye on the ball as well? All right. Uh, yeah, like that spot. Run that way, buddy. Is he out already? Holy smokes, these things knock out easy. Okay. Uh, I didn't realize how little Torpor Thorny Dragons had. No, no, no. Yes. Oh, did you see that shot? Did you see that? This guy's amazing. Okay. All right, we're going to hang out and babysit this guy for just a little bit. Man, that was really easy. We might... Uh, right, well, I'm talking smack, but there's a bunch of... Now there's like a saber. There's all sorts of badness. Saber's dead. Microraptor's eating him. Microraptor's... Has no hitbox. Microraptor is invincible. There we go. Nice. All right. We're going to hang out and babysit this guy. Unless this is a 180 moth. No. Oh, good news, by the way. I think Syntec added in uh, a mod that allows us to put potions on things and make them breedable. So I think we're going to be able to do breedable. You coming at me, bro? You want, you want a piece? Do you, do you, have you not heard about my skills, pal? What about that? What do you think about that shot? Huh? Hmm? Um, 
that is, allows us to make every dino breedable. So we're going to be able to breed uh, wyverns. We're going to be able to breed uh, moths, which is really cool. You know, guys, I've been talking about making a battle moth for some time now. Um, and we weren't able to breed them before, but now we'll be able to, which is going to be really fun. But we're going to hang out and watch this guy. And we're actually in a pretty good spot. I did see a wyvern flying over about that-ish way a little while ago. So hopefully he doesn't find his way over here. Uh, but the rest of this is like on a big hill, so a big uh, rock. So I think we're actually pretty good. But uh, yeah, we'll be right back. And it's up! It's up! It's, ah, ah, the the chorny the chorny chagging. That's right. Perfect. Wait, what's wrong with his eyes? Ugh. Is that how their eyes always look? What the heck? Oh, his eyes are back. No, they're gone. What? Ugh. He's possessed. What the heck am I looking at? Ah, that's horrible. Oh, okay. That was weird. Weird lighting. Okay, give me my... Okay. This guy's... <laughs> what the heck? And get in my ball. Nice. That guy's a great start. Perfect team. 174 lady. Uh, I'd like to get a dude to go with that guy. So that we can uh, make a baby, get a nice imprinted one. The imprint always makes it uh, nicer on gather dinos just for the all the extra bonus stats they give. Make it really nice. Speeds up harvesting just a little bit. Uh, I think we're going to start moving our base over. Grab all our dinos, start moving everything into our spot just to make sure. I mean, like I said, there's not a lot of active players on this cluster, but I'd hate to, I'd be upset if somebody stole my spot. So we're going to start moving our things over. We're going to keep our eye out for a dude dragon, a, or a, a dragon, if you would, because it's a dude dragon, a dragon. Never mind. And we'll be right back. And we're back. Okay, I went and got all my stuff. Uh, now, I am going to leave it open to the comments where we want to live, but I moved over here next to Blue Ob for now uh, into this spot. I think I prefer this spot, but if you guys would rather see me build something cool over by those ruins and have the cool gate, we'll do it there. Uh, also, I had some comments on the last video, uh, by the way, I accidentally knocked this guy out with cryosickness, uh, about a name for this guy, and I thought it was really great. So instead of uh, the Chorella Tops, he's going to be the Mozzarella Tops. I think that's a great name. Mozzarella, the Mozzarella Tops. It just makes sense because cheese and mozzarella. Anyway, he's the Mozzarella Tops. Uh, these guys are going to all stay over here. They're on neutral. They're all following the Dodic. What? You got a, you got a problem? Huh? Yeah, don't you forget who's boss around here, alright? Don't you forget! I'm the big dog around here! Alright, uh, this guy is a lady, right? You're a lady? Yeah, this is a lady, uh, thorny dragon. So we're gonna look around a little bit. I'd really like to find a dude thorny dragon of a decent level so that we can breed him out and get a nice imprinted one for the gathering of all the adobe. We're gonna need all the clay. I wanna make this whole base out of adobe over here. Uh, maybe some accents of other things, but mostly adobe base. So it's going to take a huge amount of resource gathering, and I'm going to gather my wood on the uh, thorny dragon, so I really want one to be imprinted. So we're going to look for a dude, and we'll be right back. And we're back! Okay, we're over here on the edge of the desert. Uh, so there's a really nice thorny dragon right here, somewhere, in the midst of all these other... That one right there is a dude. Is it a dude thorny dragon, a dorny dragon, a dude gun? I don't know. Uh, right there, but there's just all the bad stuff right here. Like, literally all of it. Uh, this one's going to be a lot. Even like, I'd like to land up on the hill, but there's literally two rock golems on the hill and a carno. Uh, hmm. So this one's going to be a bit more challenging, but it should be fun. All right, let's. Can I get this guy to follow me down the hill a little bit? Can I, can I have the hill, Carno guy? Can I... Wish I had more arrows, actually. I don't have that many arrows. Dude, these... These rock golems are really badly placed. Can you... Can you get wrecked? What was that noise? I didn't like that noise, not even a little bit. Okay. Alright, let's... Uh, oh, okay. Uh, I don't know what's happening. Are we okay? We're okay. Which one of you is the good one? I don't remember. Are you him? That's the good one right there. Uh, can we... Maybe we can just pull him up the hill? Like, it didn't take a lot of hits to knock the last guy out. Oh, he's stuck right there. Alright. This is gonna be okay. Maybe. 
So far, we're okay. Can you get knocked out right there? Fall over. Fall. He fell over. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna need you to... F oh no, oh no. There's a Sabre. There's a... There's a Sabre that has become part of the mountain. Sabre, please. Okay. Sabre, t oh, that was only a level six. Why was I worried about that guy? Um... Okay, there's... Oof. Vultures... I uh, See, the vultures can be a problem, too, because they... Vultures can kill you quick, because they, they'll hit you through the mount. All right, that vulture's dead. That was a high-level one, too. 162. Can we... Oh, now this vulture's mad, though. I don't really want to kill this vulture before he comes and kills me. Vulture die. Vulture. All right, vulture died. Come here, come here, come here. Up on the rock, up on the rock, up on the bigger rock. Okay, all right, good jump, good jump. I really didn't think I was going to make that. Can I kill you? Nice. There's an RG up there. That's not the best. We're okay-ish. Okay. This bow is amazing. It's like one-shotting everything. Can we take out this RG? If we take care of this... Ooh, there's RG over here. All right, let's take care of these RGs, and I feel like we'll be okay? Kind of? Maybe? If I can hit the RG? Oh, my God. Stop missing. Okay. Nice. And this RG right here. I'm going to get this one. I said we got to get this one. There we go. We got him. Dude, that was a sweet shot. Okay, I think we're... Oh, this guy over here. Nice. All right, I think that's everybody that we need to worry about. Hopefully the rock golems will come down. Oh, there's another saber up there. Dang it. Uh, let's get our kibble on this guy. And get away from him quick. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Uh, so pro tip, I always say this. When you're trying to tame stuff in a bad area like this, don't stand next to what you're trying to tame. Because quite often, uh, something will come in to try to attack you and will accidentally hit your tame. So you're best just to try to keep a safe distance and babysit from afar. There we go. That guy's dead. All right, I think we're good. Uh, as far as clearing out the area, we're going to hang out, watch this guy, Hopefully get him tamed up, and we'll be right back. And it's up, it's up, it's up, ah, ah. I was just coming to check on it because it felt like it was taking a long time, and boom, it's up. Let's go. Hi. Do you have crazy freaked out eyes too? Nope, you look normal. All right. Thank God that's over. HLNA was yelling at me the whole time. Hey, hey, you. Hey, over here. Like, they, literally the entire time. It was driving me insane. I'm so glad you're tamed. Oh, don't forget our kibble. Grab our kibble. Nice. Well, I think that was a pretty successful episode today. That's HLNA, please. I'm trying to record. Pretty successful episode today. We looked around. We found a new base location or a couple of potential base locations. Don't forget to comment down below which location you think we should choose. We tamed up a male and female, both 174 thorny dragons. We're going to be able to breed out for a super thorny dragon. And it was a pretty great episode, and I'm really, really glad to be back. If you guys like this episode, and you're glad to see Cheese back on the internet, do me a huge favor and flex on that like button. Yeah! And for more daily video game awesomeness, don't forget to subscribe! And if you're looking for your own ARC server like the one I use, make sure and check out my Nitrato link down below. They have really great servers and really great prices and excellent customer service. I definitely recommend you check them out. And if you haven't come and seen us live, we stream live on Twitch every single day. Lots of ARK and Fortnite and other fun games, Minecraft. Uh, we're going to be back on Fortnite. I mean, back on Twitch tonight for the first time in like 10 days. I'm super excited. I'd love to meet you guys and hang out, chat over there at twitch.tv slash Royale with Cheese TTV. But I love you guys. I'm really glad to be back. I'll see you guys next time. Cheese and Chugly ch uh, ch <laughs> Chugly Chowl and 
a couple of brand new thorny dragons out.